What is going on everyone? This video I am going to go over five cannoning spots for Pures and one of these spots can even get you over 90 thousand range experience per hour if this video helps you out at all then help me out by hitting that like button but let's go ahead and cut this plug and get right into it starting off with the first spot which is just northwest of this bank here in shazian it is called the giant pit this method has absolutely zero requirements but a little bit of hit points to start off with would certainly help. Though, according to the wiki, a hill giant's max hit is only four, but that doesn't sound right. That doesn't sound right to me. Anyways, just plop your cannon down somewhere in the middle of this pit. I personally stood to the south, but you might be able to get other sides to work and maybe work better, who knows, test it out. And cannoning here, you should expect around 52 to 55,000 experience per hour. I, I suppose now would be a good time to mention that these rates were taken at 70 range, so if your range happens to be higher, you might even be able to manage more experience. I have to bring up that this method is a little bit less AFK than it used to be, before they updated Zaya, but if you want a zero requirement spot that doesn't involve you fighting other players for an ogre spot over by Castle Wars, then this might be the place for you. The next three spots I'm going to just lump into one category because they are all located inside of the same dungeon. And these methods are bit more of a niche use case rather than something you would want to do as the most efficient way to level 99. That is just southwest of the giant pit that we were just at is the giant's den. In this den are fire giants, moss giants, and hill giants. This method is niche because all of these giants share the catacombs tertiary drop table and they all have chances at dropping ancient shards as well as totem pieces. So if you want to hunt totems on your cannoning trip to level 99, then this is the spot for you with experience rates being 45,000 experience per hour at the hill giants, 34,000 per hour at the moss giants, and 47 to 53 thousand at the fire giants though with the fire giants i had to set up my cannon towards the entrance and then run to this specific spot where i would end up losing all of their aggro it was weird because this entire dungeon is single way combat so when you get attacked by one giant it throws off your cannon's aggro just needless to say it was weirder doing the fire giants than it was the moss and the hill giants but surprisingly, I was getting 47 to 53,000 experience per hour doing it. Moving on though to the last and the best spot for a pure to train with a cannon, and that is easily Dagonoth inside of the lighthouse. Unfortunately, this requires a little bit of setup, but this spot, even with banking, was getting me at level 70 range 85,000 experience per hour. Let's talk about the requirements though, and those are, first off, you are going to need a decent hit points level. If you are a 10 hit points cannoning pure going for level 99 range and 10 hit points, this is not going to work for you. Even with prayer, this will not work for you, so do not even waste your time unless lighthouse is something you need to do or sorry unless horror from the deep is something you need to do anyways oh shoot i haven't gotten into that yet i guess that's a good enough transition into the fact that you will need to do horror from the deep which requires 35 agility as well as the completion of the bar crawl mini quest that they do but other than that you do not even need prayer here though prayer would surely extend the time that you have per inventory. And this test was run without using prayer. I personally was at level 60 hit points when I did this test. And I would have had to bank twice within the span of 30 minutes. So be sure to take that into account. Just go ahead and what you're gonna wanna do is set up your cannon near the entrance and then safe spot the Dagonoth by running up the ladder until you have to fill your cannon. This method is really not much more click intensive than the other two 
and at 90,000 experience per hour, I am not going to complain. And I have to say that this is where I will for sure be doing the rest of my training. Let me know down in the comments where you guys train your range at, but that is all that I have for this video. I hope you guys all have an amazing day. I'm out.